Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to another edition of Soccer As We Like It, the main United direction, the channel for United and football fans all over the world, the best and biggest fan channel of United in the United States. Right, let's get in, right into it. Man United 3, West Ham 0. United flying, came out of the block like a house on fire. But we fans were, as they say, pessimistic because we've seen it all before. We've seen this script play before. Is this just United just trying to be slick and crumble like a pack of, pack of cards? I say this. United started very fast, furious, ferocious, and were ready to take West Ham to the cleaners. A beautiful goal from a beautiful shot from Bruno, but was a great save from the keeper, tipped around the post. But United did not relent. They kept on pushing and pushing, and a beautiful goal for Rasmus from left foot to right foot, and a beautiful goal. But at this point, set pieces United were still a bit slack. Onana had to make two. Instinctive saves, grace onto him. Yay, he made the save. But at the same time, United were not done. Two goals from um, uh, uh, Ganacho, and the game was goodbye, good night, see you on your bike. But West Ham did try to come back. United could have got more goals, but the unselfish play today, the on, I use the word unselfish play. Their player, the movement of the ball was a bit better. It was more structured. There was more flow. The, the scintillating and mesmerizing football passes from Casemiro looked like prime Casemiro from Real Madrid. Ping pong passes that were crystal magnetic right to the center. Their main who played in the middle with Casemiro, absolutely phenomenal. The back four, Dallo, my man of the match, making two Last dish tackles after Harry Maguire had bloody messed up. But he got on with the game later on, but he sounded like a bit rusty because he hadn't played some fast and furious games. He needed a few uh, WD-40 spread in some of his joints because he twice he made the two, he made the two debacles, but Dalla was there to clear up and mop up the mess. On terms of Luke Shaw, played well. I thought everyone played well. Rashford was all right, average, nothing spectacular. Ganache on fire, Rasmus on fire, Menu on fire. Uh, Veran came in to replace Martinez, who sadly had an injury. I think the West Ham man looked like he deliberately wanted to break his bloody knee. I think he should have been carded. It was deliberate. There's no point in squeezing his knee. I don't know what the fuck he was fucking doing. But while you're watching, smash a like on that video. Drop your comments and please subscribe and help us get to our next destination. Our next target would be 4,000 subscribers. But with your help, we will achieve it in quick succession. So share our video, share our content. We're on all the social media platforms. So keep subscribing and keep following us on all the more social media platforms. But on another day, I thought this game was well, they were, were well rehearsed. They, they did not panic. They didn't fall in the old default mode of heads dropping when they're under pressure. They spread the game out. They defended as a team. They attacked as a team. The midfield was well conducted, orchestrated, and they, they delivered by Casimero. Um... On the flip side, I thought West Ham were uh, a bit average, nothing spectacular about them. A few chances here and there. The few two chances that Harry gifted them as presents were denied by were denied by Dallow. Dallow said, we are living here with a fucking clean sheet. So there was no chance for West Ham getting a goal. But other than that, United had more possession. It was, 70, it was 65% to 35% possession in terms of percent. United had less, had a few corner kicks more than West Ham. But this is where we are. But overall, overall, I'm going to give the team a, a 7.2 out of 10. Because it was a clean sheet, three goals, steady football, nothing spectacular, you know, if they got the fourth goal, probably yes, but Ganacho seems to be the one. But the, the highlight of that game, excuse me, was the picture those three guys took, the trilogy. Kelby Menu, Rasmus, and Ganacho. Them three guys are United's future. I'll see you on the next one. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. From all of us, it's goodbye and good night as United destroy West Ham at Old Trafford, but with the young guns for the future. See you soon. And we wish Martinez a speedy recovery. Apparently, he might be out for at least four or five, four, four or five games, but we wish him a speedy recovery.